Hello, everyone. Welcome to another Talking to Talk episode. Um, the other two episodes I can't really record or upload or whatever the fuck. Um, so, you know what? I don't care. Anyway, this episode is about Roblox games. Specifically, Roblox Granny games. And for anyone that doesn't know what a Roblox Granny game is... Okay, so if you don't know, Granny is a game. Right? It exists. And then there was a clone made of it called Piggy. I don't think people understand that you shouldn't be calling these games Roblox Piggy games. Because there is a Granny on Roblox. Which was basically a ripoff of Granny itself. So in reality, it's just a Roblox Granny game. And I have to say, they're dumb as fuck. Here's why. I've only played a couple other than Granny itself and Roblox. I've never played the actual game. But Granny on Roblox is probably the best one. And I have many others in my favorites list. That I will probably be removing because of how idiotically stupid they are. So Granny is the original. Always will be in my opinion. You can't say that it's fucking piggy because it's not. And the original Granny game uploaded to Roblox was made in 2018. In May. May 24th to be exact. If you look at Piggy... It was made after the fact. Do I know when? I'm actually going to figure that out right now. I'm actually on the page right now of Roblox looking for shit. Uh, for the piggy game. Wherever it's at. I know it's on recommended somewhere. Whatever. Don't care. I'm looking it up instead. This is probably one of the worst games. Because... Sorry to tell people, but once you're in the late game, yeah, this was made in 2020, in January. This is not the original. I'm sorry. No, not at all true. Way too false to be true. This game is stupid. Many reasons point to it being stupid. Controls, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, so what? Tells you what shit is. But what does it matter? Because usually these games are story-based and all that shit. But how can you play the game for the story when no one fucking votes for the map that everyone wants to play for the story? I've... Never played Piggy at all because, oh, Chapter 9 came out when I figured out it was an actual game. So I tried to play it and asked people to play Chapter 1. And everyone was like, ha, no, game's been out for too long. You should have played earlier. Well, I didn't know it existed earlier, so I'm sorry. Not my fault. Puppet was probably the first Piggy game that I actually liked. And actually, it's Granny Game is probably the first that I actually liked that got taken down because guess what? Licensed characters and all that shit. But they only had one chapter when I first played it. So there you go. You all had to play the same map. Didn't matter. So if you didn't understand the story, hey, can we vote for chapter one? There only is chapter one. So, Fame has, I think, two chapters, and I actually like that one, because there's only two chapters. Guesty, when I first played it, had five, and people were more understanding about that, so it's also still in my favorites. But one I recently played, Bacon, has 12-ish chapters. I'm literally still on chapter three, because I can't pass it, because no one will vote on chapter three. And I even, I, before I even got to chapter 3, I was getting angry at people because they weren't fucking voting for chapter 2. The voting system is stupid. 
if you can't ask people to vote for a map and they say, yeah, sure. That's dumb. I think it's stupid. And I think the fact that you have to pay 15 Robux to get a private server is even dumber. Because then people who can't play the fucking game for the story have to fucking switch servers constantly. It's stupid. I've probably server hopped 15 different times not knowing what chapter people were playing. Not only that, when you click play, if you're in the middle of a match, you get sent right into it without it asking if you want to join or not. Which is even dumber. I think it should say, hey, do you want to join the match? No, I don't. I want to see what fucking chapter you're playing. And then maybe join. Oh, well, we're on chapter three. Okay, I click play and immediately fucking die. St fucking stupid. The AI is way too fucking smart, by the way. It's pathfinding is way too fucking good. I think it should be more designed as a player AI without the pathfinding. I don't think it should necessarily wander the map. I think it should see a player and go after that player. Once the player is not visible, then it starts wandering the map. But then once it locates a player, it goes after that player until it can't see the player. Because it's pathfinding is way too fucking good when I can crouch under a thing and it go around and almost immediately fucking get to me. It's stupidly too smart. Period. I think the AI is way too smart. And I think that the people within the game are rude. I had someone act nice at the beginning. Friended me and everything. It was really fucking cool. And then I'm like, hey, can we play chapter two? Because we skipped it. And we said we'd play it in order. They were like, we already played that map. No, we didn't. No, no, we did not. We didn't play chapter two. So can we please play chapter two after we play chapter three? And then got mad over it. Chapter two ended up winning. And then they rage quit. And then I was in a lobby alone. I didn't beat chapter two. So I played chapter two alone in an alone lobby and still escaped with two minutes left on the timer. With four people joining the lobby, and I explained that we're moving on to chapter three. Please vote for chapter three. Everyone voted for chapter three. But then we all died. So I was like, hey, we, I'm going to vote for chapter three again. No, I want to play chapter four. But I didn't beat chapter three. Actually, no one did. We all fucking died. Let's play chapter three again. No. no. Apparently, that's not logical. Apparently, that's not a logical thing to say. Because people get their panties in a wad and are like, no, I don't want to play that map. We already did. So then, I left that lobby and started server switching. And here we are now. After I server switched for almost an hour. It is very stupid. These games have this problem for being out for so long. That. Making chapters is stupid. I think if you're going to make a new chapter. Make a new game entirely. So that people can fucking understand the story. Oh, but that's too much work, right? No, you want to be lazy and put it all into one game so that when people want to vote for a certain thing and they want a certain map to play to understand the story, they get fucked because too many people are good at the game and want to play the later levels or the harder ones. And that's where we get to the difficulty. You see... Why is the first map harder than the second map? That makes no sense. That makes no sense. 
If you're going to make the first map medium difficulty, make the second map medium or harder. And the hardest map has the difficulty of extreme. There's two maps like that. There's only one easy map, and that's the fucking second one. You are stupid if you think that that is a good design. That's dumb. Difficulty should be upgrading, not starts at medium, decreases, and then goes all the way to hard. That's not logical, and that makes no sense. You can decrease by one, but then only go up by one. Don't fucking make it so stupidly where it's medium, easy, hard. That's not logical, and that is completely idiotic to do. Now, yes, granny games have been out for a while, so why make the first map easy? What if this is their first granny game? Oh, I don't know, maybe make it easy anyway! It does not make logical sense. I'm just saying that. It makes no logical fucking sense. First map should be easy. Second map can be medium or easy. Not fucking hard or extreme. That's stupid. And if you're going to make the first map medium, make the second map medium. Don't make it easy. That's idiotic as fuck. Now, you may be saying, you're getting mad over a Roblox game. It's all of them. To be honest, it's all of them. This game has been out since 2020. Fun fact before Piggy! <laughs> so dumb! Bacon has been out since January 15th, 2020. And Piggy has been out since January 23rd, 2020. So, they're still all granny games, but Piggy ripped off Bacon. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> so no. Piggy is a clone of a clone. Or just people thought granny games were cool. Either way, you're cloning something. You're not fucking original. Fucking stop. Stupid. We. Dumb. If a game has been out for a long time, let's just say that. Game has been out for a long time. There are new players going to it. Why not make a different game for every chapter? Is that hard? Is that hard? Is it too hard? Is it? Because if it is, then you're lazy. I'm sorry, bro. It's like, if I want to play chapter one, I'm going to play chapter one. If it's not in the same fucking game. Because then, no one's going to vote for chapter one. No. And I've actually run into that, by the way. I'm not even lying. Oh, hey, I've never played this game before, so can we play chapter one? No. Alright, server switching. Hey, I've never played this game. Can we play chapter one? Sure. But we're not moving on to chapter two. Fuck. Hey, I just beat chapter one. Can we please play chapter two? No. It's fucking stupid. It just is. And I only beaten chapter one and two. I can show you my fucking... Badges, or you can go to my Roblox profile. I'll leave it in the description for you to find that I only have the first two fucking badges. Go ahead. I don't care. You can look at all of my badges for all I give a shit. Do it. I don't care. All I can tell you is 
these games are stupid. And if you've beaten them many times, stop playing so that the newer players, like me, can actually enjoy the game. Anyway, I'm going to leave this video. And then, um, I'm going to try and get into a fucking Chapter 3 lobby. And then, it's going to be fun to try and get into a Chapter 4, get into a Chapter 5. I don't give a shit.